Chances are you've heard about fascia training before, but what is fascia? Why should footballers train it? To start off, fascia is a connective tissue network in the body that surrounds all organs, bones, and muscles. Think of it like a giant spider web. It holds the body together and allows it to move. There are three layers of fascia. The superficial layer, which is right under the skin. The deep layer, which surrounds and penetrates muscles, tendons, ligaments, bones, joints, nerve pathways and blood vessels, and the visceral layer, which holds organs in place. In this case, we will focus on training the deep layer, which will enhance speed, strength, agility, balance, proprioception, and prevent injuries. How? By becoming glute dominant? The body was designed to be glute dominant. This means the human body should feel the glutes over any other muscle when participating in exercise. This is because the glutes have the most fascia inserts than any other muscle. If you feel your quads, calves, or hamstrings, this means you are not glute dominant. Modern mainstream exercises like squats and deadlifts program the body to depend on other muscles that are not the glutes, creating overcompensation and then leading to injury. This is why you want to avoid the gym until you build a strong fascial system. Fascia training starts at the foot, helping create fascial tension from the foot to the glute. This is the reason why many of the great footballers that grew up playing barefoot are so good. This is also why you tend to see that the fastest and most powerful players have bug glutes. Developing that unconscious tension is easier when young. So, how do you train it? By first learning how to retract the toes. This is not the same as curling them. Retracting the toes is a mechanism that is lost due to modern shoes and dormant foot muscles. The goal is to regain this function to start applying fascial tension. Here is how to do it. Start off by going barefoot and placing a towel or cloth on the floor then elevate the heel on top of it and start bending the very top joint of each toe. Make sure the ball of the foot is always touching the floor and keep retracting at a slow, reasonable pace. Do this for one minute and then switch to your other foot. Repeat this exercise until you can retract all your toes correctly without the towel. After this, you can move on to the next exercise. After learning how to retract the toes, you will now do it without floor support getting the foot off the ground, retract the toes, and then curl them down. Repeat this two-step process to stimulate the foot and begin the foot glute fascia connection process. Repeat this daily until you are able to do it comfortably and at ease. Once you are able to, you are now able to apply fascial tension. Fascial tension is required for the advanced fascia training exercises, which will strengthen the glute connection and increase speed, agility, balance, shot power, explosiveness, coordination, balance, and even technique. Want to learn how to train fascia? Check out the Fascia Masterclass linked in the description. In it, you will learn all the advanced exercises to maximize your potential and overall gain. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more content like this.